What's going on guys? I'm just doing a simple uh, rear pinion nut check on a 2012 Razor 800. It started out as a 50 inch, I put the Super ATV uh, five or six inch lift, whatever it was at the time on there. It's an older one. But uh, this is the one that I changed all the suspension from one Razor to another on. And he wanted his rear pinion nut checked. So I'm not gonna do the whole video because I've already done it in the past. And so you guys just, I don't need to make multiple, multiple videos of the same thing. But just for the fun of it, we will see if this one is loose or not. I just got it setting in the tool here and just gonna kind of do it by hand. The first one I did on mine, I could grab mine from like right here and turn it. So let's see. Yep, it was loose. I mean, so I was what, say about right there. And right about there, that starts to get to where I can't push it all the way down here at the end. So yeah, sucker's loose. Let me just know that that's all it is. And like I said, it was loose. So get the uh, tools coming for it. You need that seal, the little round seal for the uh, through shaft, the seal for the pinion itself. And I always change out both gaskets and you obviously need the new nut. So check your diff, guys. It is It does suck getting it out. These are the two brackets for it. All these nuts right here are pain in the butt, plus all four of them on the base of the diff itself, holding it onto the through shaft or the, the tunnel or column or whatever they call it. It's a little time consuming, but it's worth it. That right there just saved him uh, at least six, seven hundred dollars. Check it, guys. They're all loose.